Hi everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Palette Life. If it is your first time here, my name is Suma Babu. I am an artist. I am passionate about art, craft and gardening. So, you see me making videos on these three topics. Everything I am sharing through my channel is about how I do them. So, hoping somebody may find it inspirational. In the last video, we have seen uh, how to paint human hair. Today, we are going to learn uh, how to paint animal fur. So, we are going to do a canine portrait today. The same technique, we can use it for uh, painting human facial hair also. So, let's get started. I am using artist oil color for today's demo. We need Van Dyke's Brown, Burnt Sienna, Yellow Ochre, Titanium White and Paints Grey. We are planning to paint Golden Retriever's portrait today. He is a puppy. I would like to tint the canvas before painting. I am tinting it with diluted Burnt Sienna. This process is totally optional. Next step is sketch your reference. If you like to do it in detail, that is perfectly fine. But I don't prefer a detailed sketching, which I feel is time consuming. Even if we are doing a canine portrait, we should equally treat this subject as a human portrait. Like humans, animals also are unique. All of them have different features even if they look similar. So, each body part of any animal should be taken care of. And after sketching, I would prefer establishing dark tones first. We have to build structure in the fur. Don't paint individual strands of fur in the beginning. Like as I said in the human hair demo. Even if we are painting off white fur, we could see different tones throughout the body. Fix the facial features in the next step. Correct it if you have made any mistake in this stage itself. Like human portraits, you should notice the distance between eye to eye, eye to snout, mouth to mouth, etc. When to paint a background is totally personal. Some prefer to paint in the beginning, some in the end. This is my optional background. I may change it later. The direction of the fur should also taken care of. Now it is time for giving details. I personally prefer to highlight the desired area in each painting. Artists can use their artistic freedom to give some extra details in the preferred area and at the same time leaving some areas unattended.
video is useful. Uh, try this painting at home. Instead of oil color, you can use acrylic colors. The technique of both the painting is same. So, see you soon with another interesting topic. Until then, take good care of your health and happy.